next circuit ac circuit containing pure inductor so now ac circuit containing pure inductor now inductor of inductance l connected in series with an ac source so already know the definition of inductance in a previous lesson self inductance and mutual inductance the change in magnetic flux per unit current is called inductance now inductor of inductance l connected in ac source so this is the once again three mass question derived expression for current in a circuit when alternating voltage applied to a pure inductor are so that voltage leads the current by an angle pi by 2 the ac circuit containing pure inductor so the questions are arranged in examination show that voltage leads the current or current lacks the voltage by an angle pi by 2 by an angle pi by 2 in ac circuit containing a pure inductor so now inductor l is the inductor of inductance connected in series with an ac source now the alternating voltage applied to a pure inductor in a pure inductor voltage is current how they are vary already you know that voltage vary with a sign function with time that is the alternating voltage the current flows through circuit is called a alternating current so voltage and current which are vary a sign function with time now we will take the diagram this is the voltage So how much difference is there for phase difference? Here also 90 degree. So the the maximum value of phase is called the magnitude of the phase R represent peak value. The magnitude of the phase R which represent peak value V M. V M is a peak of amplitude of alternating voltage. I M is a peak of amplitude of alternating current. So now in the two lines voltage and current. How much difference is the angle 90 degree or pi by 2? Therefore, the phase difference between voltage and current in a pure inductor pi by 2 or 90 degree. Now, this voltage line how vary with the time sign function according to the simple harmonic sign function. The voltage vary with sign function with time. I show this graph. Say. sin wave or sinusoidal wave and current line here current also vary with sin function with the time so this one dotted line is a current line solid line is a voltage line what is the how much phase difference of voltage and current in a pure inductor so here angle how much 180 degree voltage current how much sir pi by 2 difference what 180 minus 90 so 90 or pi by 2 So what is the phase difference between voltage and current in a pure inductor? So pi by two or 90 degree. Now we show the formula. For voltage, this the current by an angle pi by two. So now we have the inductor of inductance connected in series with an AC source. The source voltage V equal to V M sine omega t. The alternating voltage applied to a pure inductor is very important mathematical formula. V equal to V M sine omega t. V is a source voltage. V M is a peak value of alternating voltage. Omega is a angular frequency of AC. So first to write the formula. After explain the terms, V is a source voltage. V M is a peak value of alternating. frequency of ac the alternating voltage applied to a pure inductor what happened the change in magnetic flux linked with a coil or circuit and emf is induced that is self inductance the emf induced one coil due to change of current in same coil this phenomenon is called a self inductance so di by dt di by di by dt is a rate of change of current in circuit this is a differential mathematical formula di by dt is a rate of change of current in circuit the emf induced in the inductor circuit so e equals minus l into di by dt so 
sin omega t t theta so integration of sin theta minus cos theta so minus cos omega t a omega t is the denominator mention omega example we have sin 2 theta sin 2 theta integration so minus cos 2 theta by 2 integration of sin 2 theta integration minus cos 2 theta by 2 yes sir and it is sin omega t dt integration of sin omega t minus cos omega t by omega the integral information is the data mix so i equal to bm by a integral of sin omega t into dt so i equal to bm by a integration of sin omega t minus cos omega t by omega so i equals bm l omega l is omega l so in bracket minus cos omega t cos omega t but here voltage and how vary voltage vary with a sign function with time and the alternating voltage now convert here cos to sign cos to sign now convert cos to sign so i equals vm by omega l now convert from cos to sign sign omega d minus pi by 2 minus pi now convert here cos to sign sin omega t minus the minus the minus pi by 2 so now this equation shows that current lacks the voltage or voltage leads the current by an angle how much here pi by 2 so therefore this equation i equal to i m sin omega t minus pi by 2 this is the expression for current in AC circuit containing few inductor when alternating voltage applied to few inductor or current lead current lacks the voltage or sometimes voltage leads the current by an angle pi by 2 in AC circuit containing few inductor so now where I m so in I m case what you have taken V m by omega L I am is a peak value of alternating current V m is a peak value of alternating voltage omega is the angular frequency of AC L is a inductor of inductors so this equation recognizes I m so V m take here V m equals what 1 by omega L so this equation also recognizes so interchange numerator and denominator Vm by Im Vm by Im so Im by Vm equal to 1 by omega L so here what Vm by Im equal to omega L omega L so the ratio Vm by Im which gives what resistance in DC electrical circuits but here Vm by Im which gives Inductive reactance, the inductive reactance symbol what? XL. XL. So, friends, now carefully observe this symbol XL. XL is a inductive reactance. The ratio Vm by Im, the ratio of peak value of alternating voltage to the peak value of alternating current, which gives XL. XL is called inductive reactance it is very important this point uh, Vm by Im the ratio Xl Xl is called a uh, inductive reactance so the alternate voltage passes through a few inductor what kind of reactance inductive reactance the inductive reactance symbol Xl Xl equal to omega L Xl equal to omega L now omega equals what? 2 pi fl omega equals so xl equal to omega equal to what? 2 pi fl xl is a inductive reactance f is the frequency 
of alternative source L is the inductor of inductance. Now, the inductive reactions and frequency, how they are related? Directly proportional to. How does inductive reactions vary with frequency of alternating source? So, directly. The frequency of alternating voltage increase. What happens? Inductive reactions. Inductive reactions is also increased. But in previous case, capacitive reactions is inversely proportional to frequency. Capacitive reactions is inversely proportional to the frequency of alternating voltage. But here, inductive reactions. The inductive reactions is directly proportional to the frequency of alternating voltage. Now you apply AC source. Frequency increase. Then what happens? Inductive reactions. Inductive reactions are increased. So inductive reactions is directly proportional to the frequency of alternating voltage. Now you know the graph. Excel. Inductive reactions taken along the y-axis. Frequency taken along the x-axis. So frequency increase. What are the inductive reactions increase? As per this formula, you get straight line. So draw the graph. Inductive reactions vary with frequency of alternating voltage. So inductive reactions will directly proportional to frequency and you get straight line. So XL versus frequency. So this is AC circuit containing pure inductor. So three important circuits. AC circuit containing few resistor, few capacitor, few inductor. The alternating source applied to few capacitor inductor resistor. What is the behavior of current and voltage? What is the daily difference of voltage and current? What kind of reactions that takes place? In a resistor circuit, current at same phase. In pure capacitor circuit, capacitor reactance. In a pure inductor circuit, inductor reactance. So the phase difference in voltage and current in a few register is 0 degree. The phase difference in voltage and current in few inductor or few capacitor pi by 2, pi by 2 or 90 degree. So this is the AC circuit containing few inductor.